Just a few hours, music will be avant-garde over at City Park, something that we've been anxiously awaiting mm -hmm. for like two years now, with the Louisiana Philharmonic Orchestra performing uh, back at the park for its first time since really COVID-19 took over. Music will be in the air tonight, and as WDSU reporter Heath Allen shows us this morning, the concert this evening is yet another example, Heath, of the Crescent City's unwavering spirit of resilience. Good morning. And a good morning to you. Yes, nothing like bringing a couple of the city's real treasures together as this entire region tries to recover, not only from COVID-19, but of course from Hurricane Ida as well. The Louisiana Philharmonic Orchestra returns to City Park tonight with a free concert. Uh, it seems like it's been forever since they were here before. They gathered for their first rehearsal yesterday afternoon. It was the first time in nearly two years that the group had literally physically been back together for that type of rehearsal. It was kind of like a family reunion. Well, tonight the LPO will kick off the season with a free community concert right here at the Paris style in City Park. Conductor Carlos Miguel Prieto calling this event a wonderful opportunity for reconnection, reconnecting music and nature, healing and community. As much as we've done uh, for cameras, as much as we've done virtually or uh, by any kind of uh, electronic means, that, that's great, but we miss our audience and I think our audience misses us. And there's nothing like music. I mean, what am I saying here in New Orleans? Everyone knows. There's nothing like that experience of contact between audience and the performer. So tonight, 6.30 here at the Paris Island City Park, the Louisiana Philharmonic Orchestra gathers for a free community concert. Everyone hoping, of course, that the weather's going to cooperate. It's going to be the orchestra's first full performance in City Park since April of 2019. And then on Saturday, October the 30th, City Park is going to be hosting the LPO's Halloween Spooktacular. Sounds like some scary music and some scary costumes and some scary things to see out here in the park. A lot of fun for the whole family. We're hoping tonight's going to be a great night. Music in the air. Guys, back to you.